get to pee. Easy time. Pee pee. Go. I have to color my hair now because I don't want to go on television with grays. Let's yeah. go. Okay, hold on. Step into my, this is my, this is not my closet. This is my other closet where Paul has his stuff. Um, okay. Now, come on, come with me. Why do I do this myself and not at a salon today, you ask? I don't like going. I don't want to go. It's not always like fitting into my schedule. And you know what I like? Like I didn't brush my teeth yet. This is called root perfection. Yummy color activator. I respect that this is just like a smaller amount. I need you to know I don't have a lot of, of grays. I just don't. Um, I have a lot of other flaws, but not a lot of grays. And we're mixing. Here we go. I may brush it out with this because it's a comb, but I could use a regular comb. This is good for when you, whatever, we can talk about that another day. I'm gonna have black on my scalp. I think I just decided that. It doesn't seem like a great idea now that I'm in doing this. We're breaking the fourth wall right now because today I'm going on to Mark and Kelly to announce my new YouTube series, which you're now on. You're on it, you're a star. This lunatic who turned down, gotta be 10 TV shows easy to do this clown show. All right. That's it. Now we wait. Jesus freaking. Any clue with that? How long do we wait? All right, let's go get some stuff. Want to see my coffee program? Forget it. Don't look in here. Don't look in here. All right, I'm taking a shower. I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, let's do a reveal. Do you see the grays? Do you see sparkly grays? You might see a couple. Do you see any? Be honest. Here, like, why not? I mean, that was not hard. Let's be honest. Let's be real honest. That was not hard. Okay, brush on the bottom. Always brush on the bottom. People brush them up here, they shouldn't, okay? And you don't go, people do that, you don't do that. It's just a squeeze. So, I have a thousand products, so you don't need to hawk any products right now, but the tiniest bit rubbed in your hands and just like only on the ends, just so it's like calm the beast, so it doesn't have uh, frizz, and I'm gonna have it blow and dry later, but even for myself, and you don't wanna blow dry sopping wet hair. I feel like it does more damage. You wanna do like damp hair, so let that sit. It has been brought to my attention that I'm wearing Aladdin type pants. The joke is always on me, that you'll find. The joke is always on me, but that's okay. I don't know. Is this wrong? Why not wear this? Am I supposed to look like Aladdin today? I mean, you can go if you want. I have a thing about bags. I don't like bags that look not nice, like in any scenario. And they'll come out with like a plastic CVS bag. I'm like, where the f am I going with that? Like, we don't, we listen. I know I'm a train wreck, but th that's a bridge I will not cross. When I want to carry myself, I want to get a nice tote, not like some branded weirdo drugstore tote. Here we go. Look how nice we look. Inside my outfit. I say that this show is like the Muppets because it's a bunch of like misfit, fun, good-hearted, happy people. Like we're all silly. We just want to have fun and laugh. We don't want drama. We just want to do things that we think are silly and stupid and fun and like be entertaining and, and entertain each other. And I was just talking to Chris Rosa, my producer, who loves the Muppets. And Paul and I have a running joke because there was something on SNL where the first season the Muppets were on and the head writer, Mike O'Donoghue, said, I don't write for felt. Chris DeRosa said, we are felt. So we are the Muppets. And Chris has set a goal for us that our big goal is to like get the Muppets on the show, like do a scene with the Muppets. I don't know, spitballing, like Miss Piggy and I get in a jacuzzi together or like do a spa day, but we have big lofty goals for the show. It's not fame, it's not money, it's not awards, but it's the Muppets. The fact that I got booked on Kelly and Mark to talk about my new paperback book, Business is Personal, is great. The fact that it's gonna be about my YouTube series is hilarious. Very early, normal. It feels very civilized, weird. Is everything okay? Oh, everybody's so green now. We have to be bamboo. Poor things. 
We can ask the hair guy about the color. I'm scared to do that though, because I feel like he's gonna crush my spirits. I feel like he's gonna be like, mm, because I feel like I'm on top of the world right now with my hair. I mean, I don't play games. I, there's nothing I forget. I cry if I forget. It didn't work. I don't think it worked. I think Chris was being nice. Did my root touch up this morning. It worked, but I still see him. I'm sad. Next time that you're in town, tell me I'll swing by. I'm never in town. I'm never gonna happen. I'm never here. Never gonna be in town. But you're like never. I'm in town right now. Excited! We're launching a YouTube series. Like a real oh. producer. Yeah, that's a real producer over there. You can touch him. He's a real producer. <laughs> yeah, you need like comic relief and information. That's what people want. People don't want you to regurgitate stuff that you've heard. Right. They want it real, live, and immediate. Like oh, great. right away. But we have our first two fans. <laughs> I had to pee and I don't know why I'm holding it in. It's like a contest that no one is gonna give me a prize for also, so I'm gonna go pee now, because I think that's fair. Jill Fritzo, who's Does a very it? famous publicist, doesn't want to be famous. <laughs> no. You won't be on? Look how cute you are. Just once for your outfit. You don't have to talk. Just be a little mannequin. She loves hearts and rainbows. Just, she's not gonna sue me. Are you gonna sue me? No. All right, you're gonna be on. Chanel, hearts, rainbows. This is the, this is the woman behind the woman. We fight like a married couple. Beyond. <laughs> Breaking news. Lynn is now coloring my grays with powder. We did alleviate some gray matter, or no? I don't know, I have no takeaway, no moral of the story. I feel defeated and sad. Because I'm a do it or don't. So that we got rid of seven out of 12 grays is not gonna, like no. Get in, there's no like just the tip. Like we go all the way in, or we'd go, or we'd stay out. But now we're like, now you're lubing me up and it's, no. We f***ed it, we f***ed it good. It's okay, I didn't, it's okay. She got E for effort, for sure. Let's it's talk about a product. Huh? Quick cover, root touch up. Now he's gonna say, I can send you it. You would say, I can send it to you. Oh yes, I can, I can actually send it to her. <laughs> Every time. We have a situation, breaking news. This is not current, no. That's not current. No, that's a no. That's a no. I mean, I love him, but there, it's not, this is like the Ryan and Kelly wall. No, that's Michael Bublé. Okay. This is my outfit for Kelly and Mark. This is an empty purse just for the look. These are my boots. I don't know where they came from, but I have to figure that out soon. Um, this is a Zimmerman outfit that I got a while back, like a year ago. Um, oh, this is a very special, Audemars Piguet watch. It's rare, it's green, my favorite color, and it's beautiful. Did I forget anything? Little flower earrings, stylist, me. It's a problem. <laughs> well, she was like, I don't do that. I don't do sitting very often. So I worked with Miss Piggy on Project Runaway All Stars like years ago. You did Piggy's hair? Yeah, I did Miss Piggy's hair. Stop! That's yeah. the biggest thing you've ever I know, and uh -huh. yours. I you mean, know the, her? The can you call her? The two biggest divas and the two fully glam divas, uh, you and Miss Piggy. Wow, you know can I mean? you call her and see if she'll come on our show? I can check to see. I have like a friend. Do you know her agent? Um, I have a friend that used to be the VP of the Jim Pants and Muppets. We're so. getting closer. Joe yeah. Fritzo is going to get us the freaking Muppets. Isn't that amazing? Nick, no one has a picture with Miss Piggy doing glam. <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> This is nice because this is like the first time I've been on this show with an audience since before the pandemic. So this is exciting. How long has there been a real audience? Uh, since Mark. Oh. Mark came and then the audience came. Not too much more hairspray or we're going to get into a fight. Oh, well, it tastes delicious. <laughs> the hairspray, it's yummy. I'm sure you've tasted it. The lighting is amazing here. Makes sense. We are on a show. Okay. Please welcome back to the show, TJ Maxx or Olive Garden or Red Lobster and talk of, you know, review, give like sort of a, a review. But in the meantime, we've ended up helping a lot of people. We gave a woman and her daughter who has been very, very ill, who can never go, Taylor Swift tickets. We gave a Dollar Tree mom, I call her Dollar Tree mom because she was an employee there, 
and she has four kids, and on her other days gave her a job. So we're able to be, wa I'm able to be wacky and crazy and insane. Oh, I love her trips to the dollars. Yeah, they're they nuts. Like the they're crazy. Thing ever. Yeah, because I treat it like it's supermarket sweep, but no one's giving me a prize. And it's not <laughs> Pears are never in season either. They're never soft. They're always hard rocks. It's like a perfect pear. Oh, I got pears. I didn't care about my pears. Why? Why? <laughs> Very busy. She's on the phone with Kermit right now. <laughs> if we can't get Piggy, we'll take Fozzie. <laughs> we'll take Fozzie or Gonzo. We'll take a floppy background dog, Mr. Beaker. We'll take it. We need, can we get a signal down here? Uh, Joe is currently on the phone with the muffin. But we can't get a signal down here. She can't get a signal. We're gonna have a mup, mup day. Great news, mup day. Wonderful, wonderful day. Good appearance, good energy. Love Mark and Kelly. And we got it in. We got the Muppet Show in. We talked about the YouTube show. We literally talked about the book and the YouTube show. That's it. We, we won. We, we got a big win here today. We're Muppet. excited. Literally, she's like, get me somebody with the Muppet. So here you are. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Hi, How are you? Hello.